Yo, so how's it going guys? Welcome back to another GTA 5 video. So it's the 20th of October today and Rockstar Games have gone ahead and rolled out another Halloween update into GTA 5 Online that we're going to fully break down in this video as they have included quite a few things with today's update from a bunch of new Halloween content, free vehicles, new money making methods, plus a bunch of discounts. So as always, if you guys do appreciate me keeping you up to date with all of the latest news, all I ask is you do return the favor by dropping a like down below and if you guys are new around here hit that subscribe button and turn notifications on as i do post daily gta 5 videos with that being said let's get into the video okay so first things first and of course kicking off with this week's free vehicles that you guys can get from rockstar games i did mention that last week's podium vehicle the astron was probably one of the worst podium vehicles to get to leave that podium vehicle as i did have a feeling that rockstar games were going to go ahead and release the opposite of that car the following week and it looks like they have gone ahead and done so this week's podium vehicle is the thrax which would say Set you guys back 2.3 million dollars so it isn't cheap whatsoever a very very expensive car and of course once you guys were to fully upgrade this thing you could easily spend well over three million dollars so it's definitely worth going ahead and getting for free this week whilst you guys can and if you guys have no idea there is actually a specific method on how you guys can spin the wheel to guarantee that you land on the podium vehicle every single week so if i do remember I will leave a link to that video down low in the description or as a pinned comment. So a very, very nice car on the podium this week. Definitely worth going ahead and getting if I was you guys. Now, as far as the other free vehicle that you guys can win this week, that is, of course, being the prize ride vehicle over at the LS car meet. And this week's prize ride vehicle is the Viserys, which will set you guys back 875k. And in order to get this car for free, all you guys have to do is place top three in street races for three days in a row so it's very very easy to finish top three you can actually go ahead and just invite three or four other players into your race so you can practically guarantee that you finish top three rockstar games really haven't fought through the prize ride challenges and if you guys don't have that many players that do play gta 5 online maybe you need some other players to race with feel free to go ahead and join my discord server i will leave a link to it down low as a pinned comment we've got tons of active gta 5 players on every platform always up for grinding money and having fun however as far as this week's simian showcase vehicles as you guys can see on screen we've got the zion classic the defiler the tampa the zombie chopper as well as the everon i don't know anyone in the right mind that goes ahead and purchases cars over at simian showcase leave a comment down below i'm very very interested to know have any of you guys ever purchased a car from simian showcase room and if so what car was it however before we get into some of the new halloween content it is worth mentioning rockstar games have released two new halloween masks so the one that you guys can see on screen is known as the famine mask and in order for you guys to unlock this all you simply have to do is just log on so log on at any point over the next week and all of you guys will be unlocking this crazy looking mask now there is another mask that you guys can unlock known as the green vintage mummy mask and in order for you guys to unlock this mask all you simply have to go ahead and do is complete a payphone hit mission so very very easy to do these payphone hit missions i've covered them on my channel previously so i'm pretty sure you guys will know what they're about and once again if you guys don't have an agency to launch these payphone hit missions feel free to go ahead and join my discord server down low as a pinned comment once again like i said that is the best way that you guys can find other players to complete these challenges every single week straight away now moving on to this week's money making methods rockstar games are currently offering triple money and triple rp on all of the free mode events so if you guys aren't aware of every single free mode event feel free to go ahead and google it i'm not going to cover them all on this channel but there is quite a few they're also offering double money and double rp on the beast vs slasher adversary mode as well as all of the exotic exports which is going to lead me on to a point later on in the video as one of the new halloween events known as the cerberus will include the exotic exports however but before we get onto that, it is worth mentioning this week's brand new discounts. You guys can currently get 40% off of all of the garages. 
50% off the Comet Safari, the Zion Classic, the Bullet, as well as the Tampa, 40% off the Blazer Aqua, and 30% off the Everon, the Locust, and the Neon. I can't believe how many of these vehicles that are on discount this week have actually been free vehicles on the podium in the past few months. So if you guys are like myself and you win a bunch of podium vehicles, you probably already own some of these vehicles on discount this week. However, like I mentioned at the start of the video, Rockstar Games have added in some new Halloween themed content, one being the Cerberus event. So as I'm sure a lot of you guys are aware, last year there was the Phantom Car Slasher event where a car would randomly appear out of nowhere, burst into flames and just run you over and attempt to kill you. And that car was actually based off a famous horror movie by Steven Spielberg. Now it looks like the brand new Cerberus event is also based off a classic thriller movie by Steven Spielberg where players will find themselves being chased and terrorized by a tanker truck aka the apocalypse cerberus now in order for you guys to trigger this brand new cerberus event all you'll have to do is go ahead and deliver an exotic export vehicle now here's where things do get a bit confusing and tricky as there is a ton of exotic export locations however only specific locations will trigger this event so of course all you guys simply have to do is do exactly as you guys can see on screen head to one of these 10 locations on screen you should see a blue dot appear on the map and as soon as you guys enter the vehicle to go ahead and deliver it you will notice the brand new event will trigger and the cerberus tank will try and run you guys over now there is quite a few notes that you guys do want to take note of in order to trigger this brand new halloween event Firstly, the player must be in a free roam session and not inside a building. So this will not work unless you guys are out about in free roam and not locked up in your office or auto shop or anything like that. Now you must also be on foot or in a normal vehicle. You cannot be in a helicopter, a plane, a boat, a weaponized vehicle or any special vehicle like a Geloxo or an Oppressor Mark II. So just simply go ahead and pull out any normal motorbike or vehicle and drive in between these 10 locations in order to go ahead and trigger it now you must also spend at least 16 minutes in your session in order for one of these events to trigger and you must also make sure that there is a minimum of two players in your session and you guys should notice as long as you guys have got all of these boxes ticked off and you enter any of these exotic export cars you should trigger the brand new halloween event as easy as that and finally it is also worth mentioning rock Star games have re-released all of the halloween face paints i've seen a ton of you guys asking about these face paints over the last few weeks as my character already had his one so take note if you guys want to keep any of the halloween face paints put them on your character and simply just leave them on your character don't change them because even when rockstar games remove all of the limited time content your character will still keep the halloween face paints however that is going to do it from me guys as always if you guys do support the channel all i ask is you do return the favor by dropping a like down below and if you guys are new around here hit that subscribe button and turn notifications on as i do post daily gta 5 videos thanks a lot for watching guys and see you in my next video